That's a good ball of bees right there. Those are good ball of bees. Set them right down in there. What's up? Hey, that was for uh, my buddy 628 Dirt Rooster. Yo! Guys, we're in uh, Gardendale, Alabama today, and uh, we got some bees in a column up there. According to the customer, they've been here for a couple of weeks. There's a, a little hole in the side of the column up there the bees are going in and out of. A squirrel got in there, woodpecker got in there, something. But we'll find out. Probably a bird nest. That's what I'm thinking. Probably a bird nest up in there. Well, on this situation, we're going to come down so far, just right below the hole. We're going to cut that and uh, go ahead and just take that one piece out. Hopefully, we'll have a whole bunch of bees, not a lot of comb, and uh, find our queen like we always do, right? Hope you guys stay tuned through the whole video. And uh, at the end of the video, we got a couple more uh, you can click on and uh, maybe go check one of them out. But uh, other than that, uh, let's go get some bees. Look at man. There's the little bees. And they're fanning. Hey, girls. Are you in a good mood? Hey, in a good mood? Hello. Yappy's coming to say hello. Yes, hello. come on out. Say hello to everybody. All right. What they're doing here is, is they're actually, they're creating an airflow in here. Um, there's no ventilation up at the top here. So you got some of the bees that are actually pulling the heat out. And uh, we got some that are going out looking for foraging and everything else. But you see how we got here? Uh, probably... Probably a woodpecker hole. The bees done found it. Man, this is a perfect little setup for them. Um, I expect we're probably gonna have a good bit of comb through here, a lot of bees. Um, this is just where they ended up getting in. And what's really cool, man, oh, you can actually feel the air coming out of that. That's how that's how fast they're fanning and how much the airflow that they can move. It's really pretty cool. Because he's gonna have to fix the column, probably gonna come across right here. And then we'll start working that up through there, trying to pull nails out, not, not try to um mess up over here but the way when they put these box columns together once you start opening up one things twist um if i'm lucky if i'm lucky they've nailed some stuff up in there to kind of help support it but uh it's gonna be it's gonna be a little bit of a pain because i guarantee this board goes up underneath that that outer fascia so dang it's gonna be a pain in the butt let's go check it out All right, gang, we're gonna have a problem. That's some yellow comb. They've been there for a while. And uh, I do not trust that they're gonna stop where I see them stop, man. I think we're gonna end up having bees up in top, but I'll know in a few minutes after we get some of that comb out, but the way it's looking right now, um, I wanna be wrong. I wanna be wrong. All right guys, so we're doing really, really good. We got uh, three sheets of comb out of the way. And uh, so far, I am not seeing the queen. And I mean, I know she's here, but I'm thinking she's done run up in there, come off the comb while I was working. That would be normal. Now, the fact that I've got this many bees up in here tells me that there is a top up on this. I feel a little bit more comfortable about that, that they don't have anywhere to go. Otherwise, that queen probably would have ran up in there and uh, got away from me and they would have followed her. So now I have to be real careful 
hopes that I can reduce these numbers down without catching her in the vacuum so you guys can meet her. That's the hopes. You gotta watch those corners because she's notorious for wanting to get into a corner. There she is. Oh, she's trying to hide. There she is, down in that corner. Come on out, mama. Hey, you fat girl, come on up this wall. Come on up here. There you are, trying to hide on me. I see you trying to hide. Yep, here she comes. All right, so we got our queen. Man, I hate that we vacuumed her. I wanted to pinch her. I wanted to catch her in my hands. But it is what it is. Alrighty, gang. Um, hopefully, you could see the queen down in my catch box, but uh, we're pretty much we're done now. What I'm going to do with them is go ahead, and I'm actually going to let them out and uh, try to see if they'll walk right into the box. I got some old drawn comb. Uh, we had pulled it out of the freezer and and set it up in there. All right, so there's my queen cage. We've removed a little tab so that they can get in there and feed her. But uh, overall, I'm going to. Uh, We're gonna go ahead and open this thing up. All right, girls. All I gotta do is find that queen. Come on now. Oh yeah. See, they'd already they already balled up up here. Okay. Are you gonna be in a good mood? You gonna be in a good mood? Where's your queen at? Where's your mama? She's in here somewhere. Let's move this out a little bit. Now watch, they're gonna start already smelling that. They're gonna start telling the other ones, hey, come on, get in here. So let's see what we got here. There we go. There we go. Let's see if they start fanning and telling everybody, hey, we got a home here. We got a home. Come on, tell the rest of them. Hey, we got a home. There you go. There she is, right there. Right there. Come here, Mama. Uh-oh. Get away from me. There she is. See the longer abdomen on her? Now. Let's get her. Put the cage. Put the cap on. All right, now all I have to do with her is set her right up here. Set her in the top. Sorry, girls. All right. Pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. I'm gonna let them, uh, I'm gonna let them finish up doing their little bee thing for the night and uh, we'll get them all set in, settled in and uh, move them to a hive stand uh, sometime later tonight. That way tomorrow, as soon as the sun comes up, they'll start reorientating to the new home and a new spot. We'll put some uh, feed on them here in a little bit, but uh, This is so cool. That is so cool. Don't go marching in the home. Good job, girls. Good job.